Hi, I'm Commissioner Bill Graytop, and what is your question? Ask your commissioner. With Commissioner Bill Graytop. Why is Parks and Rec looking at purchasing property in Algonac and Clay Township? St. Clair County Parks and Recreation, also known as Park PARC, is looking at two parcels of property down in the Algonac Clay area. One of them is a 9.2 acre parcel of land right on the North Channel and is right next to the DNR's North Channel access site. This area, if it's acquired, would be developed into a county park similar to what they have up in Fort Gratiot. You would have swimming in the North Channel, you would have pavilions for rent down there, there would be picnic tables, things of that nature. You probably would have a changing house down there and a parking lot down there and probably be a place you could launch a canoe or a kayak. And being that it's right next door to the DNR site, might be able to do some co-oping with them in such a way as you could launch your boat at the DNR site and still use the picnic area right next door. So there's lots of possibilities and we are exploring that right now. The second piece of property that we have and that we are looking at is back in the um, Bridge to Bay Trail, which runs behind the Algonac State Park. It's kind of a swampy, marshy piece, and there's a piece where there's a bridge that goes right over the Marine City dredge cut, which is going to be improved. These pieces of property that we're looking at there, and we already have some, the Drain Commission has some back in that area. Put those together, they'll be big enough, and they'll be right on the Marine City dredge cut that we could put in a gravel parking lot and a canoe kayak launch system, possibly a handicap launch system. Once we put that in there, from there you can take your canoes and your kayaks and you go back inland and all the way back through the state park and on heading in a kind of a northerly direction. If you want to go the other way, you can come out of there, grab the St. Clair River, and if you're really ambitious and strong and want to go upstream, go ahead. If you want to turn and go south, you're going towards Algonac and you're not far from Russell Island, Harsons Island, and all of the St. Clair Flats area. So that option would be available to you also. The other option out there is some people like to put in one place, canoe to another place and pull out. So you go up river anywhere from Port Huron or Marysville or St. Clair, throw in your canoe, your kayak up that way, work your way down the river and when you get to the Marine City dredge cut you could pull in there, you'd be inland, you'd be in a protected area, easy to pull your canoe and kayak out, throw it on your car, of course you'd have to shuffle your cars around a little bit but you could do that and then you could take that thing and, and, and go home from there. Uh, so these are a couple of the things that we're doing right now down in the south end. We don't have a whole lot of St. Clair County Parks uh, and Recreation down this way, but with these two added pieces, I think that we're going to improve the recreational facilities down at the south end of the county. Ask Your Commissioner has been brought to you by your St. Clair County Board of Commissioners. Have a question? Find and contact your St. Clair County Commissioner at www.stclaircounty.org.